He, uh, I need. That's me, bro. All his leg at the dark, nigga. All his leg at the dark, nigga. Dude. Yeah. 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 All right. Boom. We are about to get ready to watch disturbing true Snapchat stories animated. All right. Let's get it. Let me open up so I can see my chat. Boom. No. Yo, listen. I got to eat something. You know what I'm saying? Let's watch these and see what they did. What you mean, no? Yo, honestly, these, these, these really, but your face express are the best part. Yeah, I know, man. You know what I'm saying? I know what I'm saying? But look, I got to eat. I got to eat. You know, you know. But, yo, these tend to not really be too scary. But, yo, we're going to oh, watch these with an open mind. Go crazy. Hold up, nigga. This not me. <laughs> All right, but what? All right, let's go. This happened a week ago. They know. Up until a few days ago, I went to a small what you local said. gym in my now previous New Jersey town called Black Bear Fitness. One day, I had the misfortune of running into some skinny, awkward, yet creepy looking kid, probably 18 years old. He didn't look like he belonged in a gym at all. Get the fuck out of the gym. You ain't, you ain't working out. You standing around looking funky. Get the fuck out the gym. I had headphones in and I was doing my set when I heard him saying something to me, but it was muffled by the music. I was already annoyed with this kid, given that he was breaking an unwritten rule of the gym. Don't try to talk to somebody when they're doing their sets. I took my time finishing my set and then took my headphones out to ask if he needed something. Then he started acting like I looked familiar, but right away I knew this kid was just trying some pathetic attempt at making friends. I assured him I didn't, but the kid wouldn't stop talking to me. I'll skip most of the conversation, but eventually he actually asked me for my Instagram and Snapchat. Weirdly enough, and for whatever reason. Oh, my drop don't work. Oh. Oh, wait. I can't play it now, it's ruined. But yo, this the fuck, you nigga trying to shoot his shot? reason I gave them to him instead of just saying something like buddy I'm trying to work out or I don't have social media after I gave him my snapchat and Instagram however I did kind of urge him to let me resume my workout he finally seemed to get the message <laughs> not, and bro. walked away not without <laughs> saying bye like three times though that like you buddy I didn't think he's sick that night I got a snap on my phone saying from Sean I immediately sighed and said oh no just wondering why the hell the kid would snap me. I'm telling you, what? Open the snap. Oh no! They would. Oh yeah, boy. Ain't nothing like getting a motherfucking selfie. I ain't even asked for. But be like, who is this? Like a stranger? Who is you? You is not it. I don't know what you own. And the kid was in a creepy, weird pose, face way too close to the camera. That boy say. <laughs> with his head resting in his hand and a half smile on his face the text over the picture was hey with two y's i oh, muttered no. the words what the f for the record i'm a guy which made this even more weird my thought process was i've had enough of this loser already i'm gonna remove him and make it clear All I on this I him at the gym again and so I did. I removed him minutes after he sent that snap. If you watch. I'm sure not even a minute later. Again, a message popped up on my phone saying Snapchat from Sean. I waited a few minutes before opening it. This one was even creepier. Hey, Chet. <clears throat> Real moments. When somebody takes you, let's say somebody that you're interested in. You know, we got some SOTs in here, some FOTs in here. How long y'all be opening it? Do y'all still be waiting? Or y'all be like, I seen it, I'ma open it. Respond to me. 
Little ass kid. Right away. I don't wait. Fuck that, I'm grown. I'm opening it. I be letting that be simple. Hey, look, I gotta let that motherfucker simmer. I'm gonna reply next week. Nah, I'm playing. Now, nah, honestly, uh, when I see it, when I see it, if I'm not busy, I'll get to you. I'll get to you. But I be having so much shit going on. <laughs> I'm gonna hit you late. I'm bad at replying. Listen. Somebody shot this shot at me. And they like, damn. Damn, so what happened? I'm like, yo, chill out. Ain't nothing even happened. I'm just bad at replying. I'm sorry. Now the kid was sitting up oh! on his bed. No smile, more of a surprised, angry expression. The text over the image said, why did you remove me? <laughs> I need to basically put you on no Now I went as far as to block him, meaning he couldn't snap me anymore. And that was that. I threw my phone on the desk and sighed out of relief. Half an hour later, my phone goes off saying Sean added you as a friend, and then Snapchat from Sean. He actually made a new account. Mm -hmm. I opened the snap yeah, and that felt brother's my heart starving. drop. It was a picture of my front lawn. The text over it, answer me. <laughs> the first thing I could think of was, how did- I would've told him, come inside. Come on. You got the address. Open the door, bitch. I live in Texas. We legal. Come on. <laughs> Come on, bitch. Where did he find my address? Then I realized Snapchat made that new map feature that lets you <coughs> see where your friends are. Somehow I had oh, yeah, to open creepy. the window Holy to fuck. outside. It was clear out there. I shut the window and the blinds and started considering calling 911. Ew, motherfucker, nerd. Yo, Chris. I mean, I'm telling you, Buster, I'm knocking on this door. I'm scared. I'm fearing for my life. I took a deep breath, and with one swift motion, I pulled up the blind and the window at the same time and pulled the kid into my room by what his neck. What the fuck? Yeah, I punched right. him in the face a few times. Yeah, right, he was nigga. Cold. Now I called 911. Yeah, right. By the time they arrived, he was awake, cursing me out, promising he'd be back and kill me. The cops heard it all. I didn't even have to make a case. The kid was an idiot. Yeah, right. Luckily, the timing of this worked out well, because I just moved a couple days ago out of state. Only thing that worries me, I don't want to have to make a new Snapchat account, but anytime somebody new adds me on the app, I'll never know if it's secretly that Sean kid again. I'm like I say, I opened- oh. I opened the window and pulled it in and whooped his ass. Yeah, we believed you. Until you said it. Stop. Stop it. Snapchat ass anyway? Shit, I ain't gonna lie. When Snapchat first came up, that was, that motherfucker was lit. I ain't gonna lie. That was lit. Uh, and you, it was, it was crazy, bro. Um, I took so long to make a Snapchat, but my roommate kept fucking putting me on his, like, Y'all know me. Y'all see me. I'm entertaining. I just do dumb shit. So when a nigga was living with me, uh, he just kept recording me doing dumb ass shit, bro. So like, uh, I'll tell y'all an example. For um, man, one time, one time, bro, my uh, Snapchat's for drug dealers now, allegedly. Allegedly. Okay. But um, yeah, so nigga, the nigga kept recording me walking around the dorm room with one sock on. Nigga like, nigga, why you got one sock on? He recording a nigga feet and shit. I'm like, yo, nigga, why the fuck is you recording me? Me like, yo, nigga, why the fuck you got on one sock? I'm like, nigga, it's a shit, bro. I just stepped in something. Like, yo, nigga, I'm in. I, I, th I think I stepped in like, uh, like some water or some shit. I don't fucking know. And nigga, like, I'm not finna take the other sock off. Nigga, like, I'm just gonna take the one off. Fuck it. <laughs> fuck it, nigga. Duh, duh. Now I'm in this bitch with one sock. Something happened to the other one. It's the type of shit. 
So he kept putting me on his shit. Everybody was like, yo, what's this shit? What's this shit? What's this shit? So I got on Snapchat, nigga. And no, Snapchat was fire back then, but that whole ass now, nigga. Honestly, I, I, I deleted my shit. I deleted my shit and just never went back. Homeless nigga, bro. Nah, I was just, I'm cool.